Hi there, my name is Noah McKernan, and today I am extremely excited to share with you our Splitter 2X and Splitter 4X wastewater filtration systems. The Splitter X is the latest generation of penetrant wastewater filtration systems built off of decades worth of proven technology. Over the last 18 months, we've been hard at work at developing a penetrant wastewater filtration system that will be an industry leader in the non-destructive testing market. Our system utilizes nano and ultra filtration membrane technology to help remove chemicals, oils, dyes, and pigments to help our customers drastically reduce their amount of wastewater disposal and help create a more environmentally conscious workplace. In this video, I will run you through an overview of exactly how the system works. Then I will highlight some of the key changes and features that we have added to the system. Third, I will provide some examples of the type of applications that our system can be used for. And finally, what steps to take if you have an application that you think our Splitter X can help you with. In the upcoming overview, I will be using liquid penetrant wastewater as an example. Please keep in mind that although dye penetrant wastewater is our unique niche, this system can be utilized for a variety of other applications. Now on to the good stuff. So how do the Splitter 2X and 4X wastewater filtration systems work? Let's begin with a high level flow diagram of the wastewater process. In the first diagram, you will find an example of the start of batch flow. The process begins by capturing the wastewater that is produced from the rinsing of the penetrant. This is done by pumping the waste into a holding tank. Prior to entering the tank, we supply and highly recommend a pre-filtration system to prevent any large debris from entering the system that could prematurely foul the membranes. For this stage, you have the option to utilize your own holding tank or purchase one with the splitter X. Once the holding tank has reached capacity, it is time to initiate a filtration cycle from the Splitter X interface. This can also be done automatically. The system will begin pumping the waste through the pickup tube and pass it through the system in a continuous flow. As it passes through the membranes, the clean permeate will begin to flow out of the system. The wastewater that did not pass through the membranes as clean permeate will continue to flow out of the system and can be returned to the holding tank for further filtration. This creates a continuous cycle until you are left with a bit of highly concentrated waste to be disposed of. This means that our system will not clean 100% of the entire wastewater batch. In most scenarios, you can expect the Splitter X to reduce your wastewater disposal by an average of 90%, leaving you with roughly 10% to still dispose of. As for the clean permeate water, you have a few options. You can run it down the drain with consistent testing to ensure that it meets your regional bylaws. You can save it in a holding tank for use elsewhere in your facility. Or our favorite option, you can recycle this clean water back to be used in the rinse station of your penetrant system. Moving on to the second diagram, you will see the end of batch flow. At this point, your wastewater process will be reduced to approximately 10% of its original volume. This remaining waste is then pumped out to a separate holding tank for disposal, and the process tank is ready to be refilled for another batch. Now that you have seen an overview of the flow, how does the Splitter X actually filter your wastewater? Well, inside the cabinet is where the magic happens. The wastewater is pumped from the system via the pickup hose and is highly pressurized upon entry. This pressure then forces the water through a series of proprietary nano or ultra filtration membrane. While passing through the membranes, the wastewater will work its way through a surface area of 3,110 square inches or approximately two square meters for the 2X system and 6,221 square inches, approximately four square meters for the 4X system. The pressure of the water passing through the membrane surface forces small molecules like clean water through the membrane and into the clean water permeate hose. The larger molecules like emulsified oils, dyes, and pigments that are too large to pass through the small pores are flushed back into the processing tank for further processing. We can now go over some of the exciting new features and changes that we've packed into the Splitter 2X and Splitter 4X. For ultimate control from start to finish, we implemented a Siemens PLC and touchscreen. This allows active monitoring of temperature, pressure, flow rate, and cleaning cycles. This data can be displayed or stored on removable memory for remote diagnostics. 
To improve performance and serviceability, the next major change is in the membranes and membrane housing. We have streamlined our product offering to two models that process 200 and 400 gallons per day, respectively. The membrane housings are now made of stainless steel and configured horizontally instead of vertically. We changed the dimensions, structure, and construction of the membranes themselves to improve the efficiency and longevity of the membranes. Another new feature is our built-in carbon polish. This onboard carbon polish ensures that the permeate is clean and reduces any unexpected contaminants from making its way through the system. Finally, the overall construction of the Splitter X has been redesigned with the customer in mind. There are many construction changes, but here are some of the most notable. Powder-coated steel frame, durable locking wheels, hinged quick locking side doors for easy maintenance, easily removable membranes, built-in spill containment when servicing, plumbing and electrical mounted on the front for ease of use, including quick connect hoses, and so much more. By now you might be wondering if our Splitter X wastewater filtration system is the right product for you. Well, here are some of the applications that we have worked with. The most common is penetrant rinse water in the non-destructive testing market. Others include machine coolants and water-soluble cutting oils, aqueous cleaners from washing parts, floor cleaners, equipment washdowns, etc., oil water emulsions, and more. We are also very excited to be working with a variety of NDT distributors for our splitter products. So if you prefer, all of this can be handled by your local distributor. And that brings us to the end of my overview of the Splitter 2X and Splitter 4X wastewater filtration systems. I hope that this was informative and valuable to you, and we really look forward to potentially working together in the future. Stay tuned for our next video on the Splitter LP1, our new liquid penetrant inspection station. Thank you for watching.